Hi there, this is David and welcome back to Let's Play Shadow Hearts. Before we enter that door, uh, what I want to do is take off all the brigand earrings that I have on everybody and instead put on Leonardo's bears. Everyone needs them. It is imperative. Um, last time we made our way through Keith's castle again because he said that there was some sort of demon up here and we think it might be Yuri. So make sure you're all healed up and let's head on inside and check it out. See if it is him. Oh, you can sense him. Huh. Well, that's great. Oh, you fought him before? Hmm. Why would he come in here? This is like a dungeon. Ugh. Reminds me of the dungeon that the Beast threw Belle's father into at the very beginning of Beauty and the Beast. I know I've been obsessing about that movie, but it's such a good movie! Yeah, he doesn't seem excited to see Alice or anything. Oh. Maybe he's crazy. Yeah, no kidding. What's going on with him? Oh. Great. Oh, no. Oh, lovely. So I guess, um, like what those masks were warning us about has actually come true. So I guess he was caught in that explosion in Shanghai with a seraphic, seraphic radiance or seraphitic radiance. I don't know, whatever. Kill mom? What are you talking about killing mom? Wait, we're not monsters. And isn't your mom dead? Uh-oh, yikes! For boss time against Yuri himself. Yeah, whoever saw this one coming, ooh, he looks vacant and creepy. Uh-oh. Oh man, he can really do a number on our uh, characters here, can't he? Uh, let's see, we're actually halfway decent on everything here, so let's just have him attack! Let's see how much damage he does. Uh, that's not so hot, but whatever. Let's see if we give him a holy edge. Um, that really should increase his attack power, so yeah, let's go ahead and do that. I'm gonna bet on the fact that he will not attack Zhuzhin again. Hopefully. Please? So let's have him use Corpse Arm. Let's see how much damage we can get done here. I'm always like right short of perfect every single time it seems. Oh, okay, 148. That's really not half bad. Oh, good. Although it would be better if you attacked Keith, but whatever. Uh, let's see, let's have you use your Holy Edge now and see if that's any better. Uh, it's okay. Dealt roughly 90 damage or so. Uh, yeah, you're on healing duty for right now. I do want to try her, I think it's Blessed Light, the, um, her light elemental damage attack since Yuri is dark elemental and see how much damage that one does. Oh, please don't kill him. Please don't kill him. Please don't kill him. Thank you. Ooh, that's rough. Um. I, uh, yeah, do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. We've got to get Yuri down as fast as possible. I don't know why he's not attacking Keith. That would be lovely if he did, but... Alice should go before Yuri goes again. Um, you know what? I wonder if that bat dance would actually deal more damage than his physical attacks here. Because 100 damage? That's pretty crappy, I've got to say. Uh-oh. Yoinks! Yeah, whenever you get him down to half HP, he transforms into Death Emperor! And now he can inflict instant death upon your characters, which is why I said to equip those Leonardo's bears. Uh, let's go ahead and use our Blessed Light, see how much damage that does. 
that will let me know who exactly I want really to be on attacking duty and healing duty. Because Jujin can heal too. Ooh, that sucked. That really sucked, but at this point, you need to heal yourself. Yeah, so, Alice, you're definitely going to be on healing duty right now. Zhuzhen, shockingly, is dealing the most amount of damage by dealing dark elemental damage to someone else who is also dark elemental. Let's have you use your drain touch. Let's see if this deals more damage than 100. Hopefully, it does. Oh, that's really crummy. Okay, yeah, so... Yeah, I'm not gonna be using that again. We'll just have Alice heal him. Since Alice, even as an attacker, like... The one time that you would think that she would be good at attacking, you know, because she's light elemental and she's dealing with a darkness elemental, she really is not doing all that much damage at all. Zhuzhen's really, really powerful, though, so I do like him. Let's try this bat dance, though. I just, I'm, I'm just curious as to how much damage this thing will do. Ooh, I got a perfect on it. So perfect, not gonna really skew the results that much. So I was dealing roughly eh, 80 to 100 damage with physical attacks. Oh, 110, that's still not all that hot either. So I'll probably just stick to physical attacks with the um, Holy Edge there. Even though the Bat Dance is just a little bit better. I, I feel like the animation is just longer, so I just don't want to mess with it. And I know that the game's trying to be atmospheric at this point, but, like, I don't know, I wish that we had some more epic music right now. The music is just kind of boring, to be honest. There's not really much going on. It's just kind of, you know, there, which is really crummy. Yeah, that um, attack right there would be the one that can inflict instant death. So make sure, again, that you have those Leonardo's bears, and you won't have to worry about that. Um, we're actually doing okay on our HP, so next time Alice's turn comes around, I'll have her join in the fun with the offense. But yeah, Yuri, he's not that hard. As long as you know to protect yourself against instant death, you're really going to have no issues with him whatsoever. Oh yeah, he did nothing! That's what I like. You can just keep on doing that the whole time. Just keep on buffing yourself and do nothing at all. Oh, I might have to heal Alice's SP. I do have Anne's Cross equipped on her, though, so I shouldn't have to. I should just be able to hit a ring, and I'll be fine. I would like to see that, though. I don't think that I've ever really seen Anne's Cross in action, so eh, maybe we'll get to see it here. Hmm. Need to heal her up. But he really should be dead right about now-ish. He only has 1400 HP, so yeah. I mean, we're dealing quite a bit each round. Hey, and we got him! Oh, Alice? I guess you're in Yuri's mind. Yeah, the graveyard. Oh, we're all healed up, so that's nice. Oh. Oh. That's kind of cool. It's interesting, whenever you examine these gravestones, whenever Yuri looks at them, he sees, like, the evil in these stones, the evil in these elements. Whenever Alice looks at them, she sees, like, hope. She sees the good in these elements. A, mom's, a mother's warmth. Hmm. 
yeah, trust in one's companions. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. Longing for one's father. Ugh, Foxface. I don't long to see Foxface, but whatever. Maybe these masks can shed some light on this situation here. Oh, well, thanks. And we get this up panty shot here. <laughs> Wait, we have to sacrifice ourselves for Yuri? Yeah, what's going on here? Um, you're just masks. Why would we be scared of you? Oh. Oh, no. Is that why we're here, to save him from himself? Yuri suicidal? Oh. Oh. So I feel like we're talking to Yuri's doubts right now, these masks. I feel like they're part of Yuri's consciousness, and they're telling Yuri, like, all these horrible things. It's kind of like um, the little devil on your shoulder, you know? And Alice is coming in as that angel on the shoulder to lift him up, lift him out of his funk right now. Um, yeah? Yeah, I would. Oh, don't say that. Well, we have love, companionship, affection, friendship. You know, we have a lot to offer, Yuri. Maybe he yearns to be free, you know, free of the burdens of these masks here. free of the guilt and the doubt over his mother and father's deaths. Oh. Well, yeah. I think at this point Alice is in love with him. Is she not wearing any underwear? I'm sorry, I, I can't stop looking at this. Like, her crack is right in my face, and I don't see a panty line, I don't see any underwear, I don't see anything. And her skirt is so frickin' short, it's ridiculous. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm done now. Like, she looks well put together, well dressed, but it's, I don't know, she needs to finish the outfit. Wait, we're gonna bear his karma? They're gonna come for Alice's soul, too? Oh, I don't like the sound of this one bit. You can see her ass cheeks even better from this vantage point. Alice, cover yourself. This is 1913, not 2019. Uh, I digress. Anyway, this gate's now open. What are you doing? Wait, this looks like that scene that we saw much earlier in the game whenever Yuri was talking to his father. Grave? Are you digging your own grave? What grave? Wait, we're not your mommy. Are you digging your mother's grave? Oh, yeah, he is digging his own grave. We've got to snap him out of this. This is too much. Oh, 
And who are you? Oh, it's Foxface. So Foxface is really controlling him. Yeah, he did. Oh, that's what's happened. So he wanted to fuse with it maybe to stop the destruction of Shanghai, but it didn't work out the way that he planned. No kidding. This doesn't look like help to me. Well, they kind of will. That's what that malice indicator's for. Oh. Oh. He kind of already did. Hate to break it to you. Grab his shovel, do something. Like, I don't know. Shoot Foxface with your holy light. So this is really what's going on. This is, Foxface is also part of his consciousness. All of his fears and his doubts and his worries personified as his father. But his father isn't exactly showing his face. Yeah, don't crowd Yuri out yet. for Alice. She's crying. Well, yeah, because she loves him. And she doesn't want to see him hurt. Whoa! Holy crap! Oh, well, that snapped him out of it, I guess. He should have thrown the shovel at Foxface. Like, what the hell? Um, we're going to kick your ass. Again, Alice isn't your mother. Ah! guy's abusive. Yikes! Uh, hey, we got him. Uh, yeah? Oh, no. Whoa! Yeah, he's just your fear and your doubts. You know, just fight them off. Just repress. Bottle it up. Don't think about it. That's what I was always told to do. Probably not the healthiest thing to do, but fighting them off, that's much healthier. Oh, and we get much better music, too. For boss time! Against Foxface himself, Yuri's father. But can we actually defeat him and free Yuri from his from himself? Find out next time on Let's Play Shadow Hearts. This has been David. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe, and have a good day.